Hey guys, this is Exodus Gear, and recently the developer of Rust released a statement saying that they will be working on different games while they're still trying to work on Rust. They will be using some of the funding from Rust to actually work on some of those other games as well. And there's been a lot of controversy back and forth about it. Um, I'll admit it, I am personally against it, and you know, that's, of course, everybody's entitled to their opinion. If you're for it, great for you. If you're not, you know, whatever. Um, but they also stated that they've used some of the funding from Gary's mod and Rust, and that they've more or less spent about one year, two years um, working on it. And I find that to be a little bit of uh, crap, because I, I kind of personally feel like their development should be coming out quicker. There should be bigger updates fixing a lot of the things. Um, also, he's got a team of people working on this, so, I mean, come on. Um, so what I decided to do is test the waters a little bit. I will be using the same program that they're using, which, if I'm not mistaken, should be Unity. I don't have any other code, but I'm going to see how far I can get within a one-week time frame as close to Rust as I can. So if I fast forward through some of this, it's because I'm building models, I'm doing programming, um, you know, I'm doing a whole bunch of different stuff, putting it together, and we'll see what we have towards the end. But again, you know, it's it's too simplistic. It's I still feel like they should be building more than what they're actually putting out. So I don't I don't know what's happening. You got to let us know here, uh, Gary Newman, because it, it doesn't seem right to us or to some of us at least.
Okay, so we're on the last portion of it now. The only thing I need to do is actually remove a few things and turn on some scripts. Turn on the enemy AI. And I was working on their health bar. It might not show up. Uh, the player health bar, of course, is working. Combat is working. So if you keep an eye up here, he should be taking damage. Let's go ahead and start this up real quick. We've got some of the models that I built and some of the models that I got for free. We get on top of the buildings. You see our enemies out there. We can highlight them. I decided to add in a different targeting system than what they have. They actually have no targeting system in Rust. And this is just because, well, you don't want to smack some of your friends upside the head with tomahawk sometimes. Also added in the light, night light system. So it isn't just daytime and nighttime. Whenever nighttime hits, some lights will come on. If we stare off towards the distance, we should see the sun come up soon. There it is. I already started working on implementing a inventory system, which shouldn't be too hard. And, of course, we've got some other stuff out here. More foliage, different trees. We've got our water system out there. We just can't see it because of the darkness. So we'll wait a little bit. There we go. So yeah, that's really about it for this real quick, guys. And, uh, you know, we'll go over it a little bit more here in a moment. And the, the stuff that I didn't build was the building system, of course, but I, I feel like that could actually be done. Uh, it would probably take me a little while, probably about a month or so, but it would probably be just very simple, you know, check grid system or checking the orientations of uh, game objects, whether it be X, Y, and Z, you know, whatever else. Uh, so I think that, you know, could easily be done, could, add, could be added in. The combat system, if you watched earlier, does work. I did take damage. The only thing that I didn't have set up was their health bars. I was testing that out. Um, but an FPS combat system could easily evolve from what I have on here, of course. So, again, guys, you know, look at this. Look at how far the, game, the game's come. And, you know, judge for yourself. Is it really fair that they're putting that much effort into other games when they could be putting it into Rust and definitely have a lot more stuff out than what they do. So, that's really about it, guys. Enjoy.